profound change is coming to the skies above Western Europe. A vast icy breath from the far north is preparing to descend upon us. This is no ordinary winter chill. Meteorologists are tracking a significant Arctic air invasion, set to arrive with an uncompromising grip. On December 3rd, 2025, a mass of intensely cold polar air will sweep southwards, dramatically altering our weather. The warmth of late autumn will vanish, replaced by a sudden severe drop in temperatures. This is a powerful reminder of how events in the distant Arctic can shape our lives. The term Arctic air invasion paints a vivid picture, a forceful push of frigid air displaced from its home over the North Pole. Imagine a great invisible river of cold spilling over the usual atmospheric boundaries. Its arrival marks a stark transition, winter in earnest. The transition will be rapid, with temperatures plummeting in hours, not days. The air that will soon envelop our towns has journeyed from a world of sea ice and polar bears. This Arctic invasion is a powerful messenger from the planet's northernmost frontier, reminding us of nature's immense forces. The polar winds bringing this deep freeze originate in the high-pressure systems over the Arctic. During the long polar night, the land and sea ice chill the air above to extreme temperatures, creating a dome of frigid air. Normally, the jet stream contains this dome, but when it weakens, the cold escapes. A southward dip in the jet stream opens a gate, letting dense, cold air spill into Western Europe. As it travels south, the air may pick up moisture, leading to snow showers, especially along coasts and higher ground. When you feel that biting wind, you're experiencing air from the silent, ice-covered Arctic. The movement of these polar winds is a vital part of Earth's system for balancing heat. But when the blast is strong and direct, its impact on our temperate world is profound. This is precisely what's forecast to happen. The effects of this Arctic air invasion won't be felt equally. The United Kingdom and France are at the epicentre, facing the most dramatic temperature drops. Daytime highs may struggle above freezing. Nights could plunge deep below zero, especially in rural areas. Scotland, northeast England and northern France will feel the coldest first. Belgium, the Netherlands, Luxembourg and parts of Germany will also see sharp drops. Even northern Spain and Italy will notice a distinct chill. The most extreme cold will be over the UK and France, where the polar winds arrive with full force. This rapid plunge is what makes an Arctic air invasion a significant event, demanding attention and preparation. To understand this Arctic blast, we look to the polar vortex, a vast, cold, rotating air mass over the poles. In winter, the vortex strengthens, usually held in place by the jet stream. Sometimes, the vortex is disrupted, weakened or stretched by large-scale weather patterns. When this happens, a lobe of cold air can break away and drift south. Meteorologists are observing this now a weakened polar vortex letting Arctic air pour into Western Europe. This process is sometimes linked to sudden stratospheric warming, which disrupts the jet stream. The result, a deep southward dip in the jet stream, guiding Arctic air our way. This cold snap is not random, it's the result of a chain of atmospheric events. The barrier containing the planet's coldest air has been breached. It's a powerful demonstration of our interconnected climate system. A sudden, severe temperature drop ripples through every aspect of daily life. Transportation suffers. Icy roads, frozen railways and airport delays become common. The cold strains our health, 
especially for the elderly and those with heart or respiratory conditions. Hospitals see more admissions for cold-related illnesses. Schools may close and businesses can be disrupted as travel becomes hazardous. Homes face risks too. Frozen pipes and surging energy demand can cause major problems. The rhythm of life slows, people stay indoors, streets quieten and routines are upended. While snow can be beautiful, the reality is one of inconvenience and risk. We're reminded that, despite modern comforts, weather still profoundly shapes our lives. Preparation and adaptation become essential. The deep freeze forces us to rethink our daily habits. Predicting an Arctic air invasion is a triumph of modern science. Meteorologists use a global network of weather stations, balloons, ships and satellites to collect real-time data. This data feeds into powerful supercomputers running complex weather models. Ensemble forecasting, running models with slightly different starting points, helps gauge possible outcomes. Satellite imagery tracks the movement of air masses and the jet stream. Forecasters combine all this information using both technology and human expertise. The result accurate, timely warnings that give us precious time to prepare. It's a testament to decades of scientific progress. With clear forecasts, we can take practical steps to protect ourselves. Dress in layers, thermal base, insulating mid-layer and windproof outerwear. Don't forget hats, gloves and thick socks. Staying dry is as important as staying warm. Prepare your home, check heating, insulate pipes and block drafts. Know where your water stopcock is in case of burst pipes. Avoid non-essential travel during severe ice or snow. If you must drive, prepare your car and carry a winter emergency kit. Stock up on food, water and necessary medications. Stay informed with the latest weather updates and heed local advice. Preparation is your best defence against the cold. A little foresight goes a long way. Community strength shines during a cold snap. The vulnerable, elderly, disabled or those living alone need extra support. Check on neighbours, offer to pick up groceries or clear icy paths. Community spaces can serve as warm banks for those struggling to heat their homes. Support local shelters and charities helping the homeless. If you see someone in distress, contact local services. The cold doesn't discriminate, but its effects aren't equal. By looking out for each other, we ensure everyone gets through safely. The Arctic invasion will eventually recede as milder air returns. But the memory of the deep freeze lingers, reminding us of nature's power. While a single cold snap isn't a climate trend, it happens within a warming world. Some research suggests Arctic changes may make these events more frequent. Living through such an event connects us to the planet's wild places. It's a lesson in planetary interconnectedness delivered to our doorsteps. As life returns to normal, let's remember the importance of preparation, community and respect for nature these events are part of Earth's ever-changing story, and so are we.